Keeping a house warm in these sub-zero temperatures is tough enough, but what if you live on a boat more suited for summer? One adventurous sailor is pulling it off in Detroit tonight. 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel climbed aboard to show us how. Well, right up here is the Detroit Yacht Club. You can see the docks right there. It is freezing outside. You can actually see some of the condensation on the door of this Chris Craft because inside, this is where one man is calling home. Welcome aboard the Hazen S. Pingree. Hazen Pingree was the mayor of Detroit uh, at the turn of the century, and he's uh, he was known as the idol of the people. Pingree, the 50-foot Chris Craft constellation, sits in the lagoon at the Detroit Yacht Club, using a system around it to keep the water from freezing. Inside, heaters are keeping its captain, Jim Colangelo, and his first mate, Hazel, warm. So over here is a twin bunk um, for guests, you know, whoever wants to stay. Um, and then right behind you is the... Uh, the full bath. And then here's the kind of the master bedroom back here. So yeah, this is, you know, where I sleep. In negative degree temps, the biggest question, why? Yeah, I'm asking myself that a little bit right now, but for the most part, um, it has a lot to do with, you know, I kind of have this, this idea in my head around trying to do things in my life where I don't have a lot of regrets about not doing things I've wanted to do. So following a stint in New York. This is basically the living room, yeah. Um, I would say this is probably where I spend most of my time. Colangelo moved back and then on board after selling his gross point home, calling this chapter a challenge. I learn something new every day, whether it's a new, finding out what a new creaking sound is that I've never heard before, uh, which happens every day. The microwave over there is kind of wild. It's like, um, kind of a Jetsons thing, but it works. He says this adventure is a means of combating complacency and boredom. I don't have any yard maintenance. I certainly love that. Oh, and get this. He drives to Lansing to work for the state every day. <laughs> this is worth that drive. Yeah. In your mind. Totally. Yeah. And it's a great job. I really love it. So that's worth it, too. Honestly, pretty cozy place to ride out the winter. Oh, there's TV, too. Reporting on a boat at the Detroit Yacht Club. Brian Abel, 7 Action News. He said totally. Wow, he drives to Lansing. I'm on a boat. That's he, what he said. Yes, I guess he's saving money, too. Wow. You got to be, right? So. On top of all that, Jim tells us he filters his drinking water right out of the Detroit River. So, there you go. I thought you got to get the ice out of it, too. Yeah, I'm sure. It's got me thinking, though. All right, very good. All right, uh,